All right, we are at ops. It wants us to do ops as an engineer. So, uh, oh, Toothless is an engineer, so that sounds good. Let's set it up. Begin a round of ops. Let's go. All right, excellent. Beginning round of ops, we're just waiting for Jordan. I'm just kidding. No, I, did, did. I know, we're already on Toothless. <laughs> Too bad it shows. <laughs> Oh, just <laughs> yeah, the top. It doesn't show me. Uh, I don't see it at least. All right. What that spawn over here? All right. So we're gonna do ops. This is uh, we can't die on one on one of these. Set up boss before those plants show up. Sure, I'll do that. Yeah. This is the one where we can't really die on. Oh, are you sure? Well, if we if, if we survive, then if we survive without dying, we get a medal. Okay. Is it just the first thing or the entire thing? Just the just the first match, the whole match, the first whole match. Oh, okay. Of course. I find it a lot easier to die to the uh, plants. I'm sure that's going to go well. And Toothless is here, for those of you who are wondering. He's not on the call, though. Yeah, he he's currently uh, not one to speak with us <laughs> for some reason. I mean, that's <laughs> partial truth. I mean, it's true. It it's has just, nothing you know, to do it with us. That way. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it has anything to do with us. I mean, it could. I mean, you, you know, you're, you're kind of something sometimes. I'm nothing all the time. I don't know if that's worse. <laughs> <laughs> it's the best. Okay, you can say so. You wouldn't lie to me. Don't ever say that. You never know. You <laughs> <laughs> can never be too certain with you. <laughs> Alright. Actually, I should just stay back in the back while you guys fight, and then I'll stay alive. Huh. That would be a good strategy for me, personally. I mean, sounds pretty good to me. Maybe we should let Toothless do everything. <laughs> <laughs> One time I did a, a Destiny uh, strike without getting any kills. Was I with you then? Probably. <laughs> it sounds like something that happened. <laughs> I remember you not being very useful in a lot of them. <laughs> You'd be off doing something else at the time. It was <laughs> just like... Yeah, that wouldn't surprise me in the slightest, actually. <laughs> Watch out, Toothless. No, wait, not you. Not you, Jordan. Okay. Oh, oh you said Toothless, so I'm cool. <laughs> <laughs> I wish my drone... Is there an upgrade for the drones that just does massive damage all 24-7 of the hour? 24-7? Uh, I don't know. 24-7 <laughs> of the hour? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're real good at English, you know? English is my first language. So. It's almost as if you it's almost as if you've gotten five hours of sleep each night for the last week. <laughs> that is actually what has happened. <laughs> that is, believe it or not. Thanks, Popcap. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you, Popcap. It's all your fault. It's both the best blessing and a curse. Boom, boom, shoot him in the faces. Such disgraces. The rhymes. <laughs> <laughs> really? I made up that those two words and they rhyme. Oh, nice. Dude, this quick hide. But where? Where are we hiding? Uh, in somewhere. In the middle of the night. In the middle of the night. You ready to win? Uh, go, this is the last go. wave, right? No, there's five waves total. Oh. I'm not sure if I can count that, huh? Sportal combat? That sounds like mushrooms. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what to think. Oh, oh, it's the trippy mushrooms as well. No, thanks. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> no tripping. I'm gonna make sure they don't uh, sneak up this way. They are. Why don't you? 
pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up. Oh, oh thank you. Alright, we're doing pretty good, right? Yeah, I mean, we haven't died yet. It's a second wave, that's pretty good. Oh. Done that, Cap. Game over. Do you think they'll buff the knot cap? I hope. He's not very good. <laughs> Jeez, not very good. <laughs> I hope it's coming soon. Yeah, we, we could really use Because she can get one hit killed by Super Brain. She needs to be buffed. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Can't have that. I'm going to actually kill this guy. No offense. And pop that there. Why are these so long? I really don't know. I think it's because it takes forever th for them to actually walk to us. Oof. Oh. Thought you nearly died there for a Whoa, second. Oh, my... My artillery thing moved. Yeah, when the dandelion blew up, it, I think, picked it up and moved it. I wish they would send these beginning waves a little quicker. Yeah, me too. We're just too good for this, you know? I agree. We're the most professional players. Uh, maybe. I'm gonna turn on the air conditioner a little bit higher. For just your room. Just my wish. <laughs> you need, just get a window unit, you know? No, it's that's too, a classy look. It's too loud. That's true. I can't be doing that. Yeah. Do you have a problem with your office getting like really hot? Yeah. Cause I do. Because <laughs> of all the computer equipment, you know. Yeah. And I moved L's computer in here now too, so it's oh, like. Oh god. Yeah. We need to throw away L's computer. Mm, it produces too good. much heat. <laughs> I think I'm gonna get some better uh, fans and stuff for it for sure though. They're a little bit loud, I need to get something that's actually quiet. Alright, so what's the, the deal? Um, there's plants, we need to kill them because we are zombies. Okay, I I'm all for that. I can understand that, I can wrap my head around that story. It's a, it's a simple concept, um, but you know, it, it's it's a tale of time. Plants True. kill zombies, zombies kill plants. Yeah, I mean, that goes way back. Exactly. To the biblical ages, I hear. Heavy helper destroy. No, don't destroy them. Oh no. My song is, know what you did in the dark. Follow boy? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Are you gonna go see them with Weezer in Green Day? Probably not, but I don't know. Uh, I think we're gonna try. Uh -oh. But there's no, there's none that's close to us awkwardly. Closest one in Chicago so far. Toothless is hurt. Uh oh. Uh oh, Toothless. Don't die. I'll try to help him. Goodness gracious, I keep taking damage. No damage. I don't want to have damage, but I do keep getting damage done to me. Yeah, but I said none, you know? Okay, yeah, but despite that, it just keeps happening. <laughs> yeah, clearly, you're not playing it safe enough. Okay, I'm trying to play it safe. Are well, you playing it so safe that you see no action? I think not. <laughs> True. I was trying to also make Post exciting center. videos. Are you saying hiding behind a tree for 20 minutes is not exciting? In Fortnite it is. Because <laughs> you never no, know what's going to around the corner. That's true. I mean, you never know what plant will be there. Oh my god. Could be a sunflower. Oh yeah, you know what? I forgot I can put down the, the, the speed things. Oh yeah, I popped one down a minute ago. Well, don't attack. Falls asleep. Ooh, not me, not me. 
<laughs> oh. Oh, Snapdragon. Yeah, they made a lot of fire. What the heck? Yeah. Spicy. By the way, by the way, for your Taco Bell update, they made a new chalupa. Just so you know. I've heard. It's a cheddar cheese chalupa. I watch for review bra. Uh, do a food <laughs> review of it. Review bra. <laughs> All right, well, we'll he's, wave three complete. Old uh, report of the week. He's he's the best food reviewer, of course. What's the name again? The report of the week. Oh the yeah, 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 yeah. That guy. He's also known as Review Bra. Oh, I didn't know that's what his name. I didn't know he's known as Review Bra. Yeah, it, it's like his. Uh, I think it's actually what his channel is called, and anybody goes by with the report of the week. Okay. Yeah. And and he likes a new chalupa. Well, I don't know if he liked it or not. I haven't fully watched it. I just saw what it looked like. Oh, it looks okay. I've heard it was good. Yeah, I really like Toba. I had the triple crunch wrap, though. I finally got that. No, oh, I never got it. I missed uh, out. It was really good. A little bit soggy, though. Like the, the what well, was supposed to be crunchy in the middle. Yeah. It was a bit oh, disappointing it? in that way. Yeah. How? It was a bit soggy. It just got a bit soggy inside of the tortilla because the meat soaked it up. Oh, okay, yeah, that makes sense. But yeah. I ordered the forbidden taco. Forbidden taco? Yeah, they have a new forbidden taco. Oh, what is that? It's black. Oh, that sounds It's like safe. a blue tortilla, I mean. It's like dark blue. Oh, oh, like the blue corn tortillas? Yeah. Oh, okay, that makes sense. It has some sort of a cheese sauce that's forbidden. Oh, is it spicy? Uh, I don't know. Oh, okay. No, 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 no. I, I, I do know. It's, it's not that spicy. Oh, okay. I really like Taco Bell, and I really, I didn't realize how cheap it was until the other day. Like, I got a $5 Chalupa combo box, and it came with, like, a burrito, a Chalupa, and a taco, and then these little dessert churro things, and it was just like, this is a lot of food. <laughs> this is too much food. It kind of was. Oh, my gosh. They're on our base. Don't worry. I'm almost got one of them. waves just take forever they really do we didn't get the special bonus wave did we so no there's not uh well there's not that yet but the, the final wave will be some sort of like a wave that you know, yeah. spins yeah like a slot machine or whatever yeah yeah where am I going where am I going I'm not, I'm not doing too great. Oh no. Trying to kill the rose. Got it. Are you jealous that I got to see the Jonas Brothers the other day? Yes. MBB Rexa. Ah, oh, more like. Wait, no. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong video. <laughs> oh, I was shooting Toothless accidentally. Sorry. Oh no. Oh, and Dr. Phil's son uh, was the opening act as well. Apparently he sings. What was his son? Uh, his name's Jordan McGraw. Oh, cool. Uh, he was really bad. <laughs> oh. It was not nice. So, who's McGraw? Is that Dr. Phil McGraw? Yeah. Who's the other McGraw? Are you thinking Tim McGraw? Tim McGraw! <laughs> the country artist. <laughs> yeah, what's the story behind that? Uh, he's probably a different McGraw. It's probably the story. <laughs> it's a boring story. <laughs> it's probably true, though. <laughs> yeah. I'd it's rather like... have an exciting story than a true story. Did Toothless yeah. die? Oh, God. Oh, oh no. But there's also, I mean, I've heard of Adam Scott before. Is there any relation? Probably, no. yeah. <laughs> you well, make it we, so. We, trace, we can at least trace it back to Noah's Ark, because we know that there are only two humans on the Noah's Ark. 
I thought there was more than two humans. Oh, I don't know. Maybe there were. I think there was more than two humans. I thought it was I two of every animal. A lot. I'm yeah, but there was more than two humans in the thing. But I'm pretty sure. Yeah, but Noah, <laughs> Noah, you know, got busy with them all. I'm not sure if that's how it went, actually. <laughs> well, fine, we can trace it back to Adam and Eve then, whatever. <laughs> sure, okay. Because Adam got busy with them all. <laughs> with, with, with Eve and the daughters. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Sutha said sorry. What is he sorry about? Oh, I guess where he died. Oh, I hope it doesn't count against me. I didn't die. <laughs> I didn't. Oh, yeah. Oh. Hey, Google. Who was on Noah's oh. Ark? I love this big pumpkin thing. This does not answer the question. There's a song <laughs> called <laughs> Arca Noego. <laughs> what? <laughs> All right. My song, honestly. Did you see the bosses? We I don't know how hard they are. I was looking at the scary. bosses. Either. I was trying to figure out who all was on Noah's <laughs> Ark. It's more important. There was like a, a cucumber and a squash and a oh, a little cuke. Big, it was like a big pumpkin thing. Oh. Like, uh, hey, oh, tell that flower to stop. Stop healing him. Hey, stop them. Oh, he's he's spitting out golf balls or something. Yeah, I think that was, uh, I don't know, you know? What, what do you, what do you not know? A lot of things, actually. What, what, mostly, what do you not know? Um, Luff? Yeah. You know, <laughs> just, just general laugh things. How to tie my shoes, all that good stuff. Chopper. Get to the chopper. Get to the chopper. He's right here. Oh, stupid guy. Where'd he go? Huh? Alright, it's okay. I'm gonna put down one well, out. No. Oh, man. This is much more aggressive than I ever am. <laughs> yeah, me too. I'm like a big baby that just stays back here. Well, I guess it kind of makes sense to be aggressive sometimes, you know? I disagree. <laughs> whoa, 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 where am I? Where am I? Help! Sorry, zoned out for a second. Yeah, <laughs> you were just running <laughs> towards the huge, <laughs> like, fucking... <laughs> I'm actually really uh, sleepy and I keep almost dozing off. <laughs> Same. I keep almost. <laughs> we gotta fight this pumpkin squad. Oh. Oh dear. At least you're not alone. <laughs> <laughs> We're both running on four to five hours of sleep right now. I still have to go walk tonight. Oh god. Okay, I need to leave the and heal. Well, so Ari, I think we're, I think Ari's okay to walk now. She still has stitches, but they told us not to have her walk, but I think she's fine. Like, she's been yeah. doing things what by herself now. <laughs> no, I mean, like, she seems, it seems fine for her to walk around, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. Like, this is... I mean. That's joking. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got one of those guys. Now who's next? Um, the pickle. Pickle Rick. What is she shooting golf balls or something? What the heck? Yeah. Is, is it the... who? What? What's the story behind him? Maybe it's Bron, because he's a pickle? Yeah, but what, what's with the golf balls? I really don't know. They don't hurt that much, which is the weird thing. Oh, they are so annoying. They really are. They really ground my gears. Oh, wait, that's not what Pickle Rick says, is it? What does he say? He says, I'm Pickle Rick. <laughs> yeah, expletives beyond that, but. Oh, hey, corn. 
Hang on, the that corn was pretty darn good. <laughs> oh, he went around this way. This pickle guy. Wait, was there two of them? Because he's like healed. What's his name? Uh, Pickle Rick. <laughs> what? Is it really? <laughs> oh, there's now. Oh, there's two of them. Why is he healed? Oh, there's, there's two? Yeah. There's one over here as well. I don't like that. No, me either, actually. I specifically don't like it at all. Get out of here. Oh, there he is. Sorry, zoned out. <laughs> <laughs> fell asleep. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, I fell asleep. It just like it just zoned out. <laughs> with my eyes closed. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, just with uh. Well, it's way just late. Some, uh, <laughs> yeah, I don't actually know what time it is. I choose to not know. <laughs> it is 12:38. Central Which time. means it's 1:38 for me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. It's okay. I went this Oh gosh, I've nearly been up 24 hours. Oh lord. Jeez. <laughs> yeah, I'm nearing that. I take a nap or something. <laughs> yeah, I'll sleep for five hours and be back back at editing. <laughs> we got one of them. Nice. Whatever these guys are. As long as the commenters say that the videos are worth it, you know, it's it's all good. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so who else as was long as they okay. become members. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's another one over here too. Yeah. What the heck. He can poison for some reason. Now why is that? Uh, what is his story? I don't know. You should ask him. What's your story? All right. He's gone. His name was Bitter Dill. No. So he is a pickle. <laughs> dance party? No, no dance party. Oh, what do we fight now? Uh, there's like some sunflowers and stuff over here. Oh, they're attacking Oh, they're hitting. Yeah. Okay, well, I guess I'll go back to. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, there's a cactus. There's like another plant. Oh, there's a sunflower oh, still. A sunflower. Oh yeah. Yeah, way over here. Oh gosh. <laughs> Why? I don't know. <laughs> they can't make these things short, can they? I guess not. Alright, I killed a hill weed that I guess would have helped them, so. Yeah, the heal weed is instrumental here. Hey, you heal no. <laughs> oh god. Joke's on you when the heal weed doesn't save him. What happened? You, you uh... Almost dead, almost dead. Okay. There we go, boss wave completed. No knockout bonus. Perfect job completed. Yeah, nice. Unfortunately, Toothless probably didn't get that. Oh no. <laughs> yeah. He might not have known. Oh man. Whew. At least we beat him first try. That was nice. All right, let's do it as Captain Deadbeard. Let's do it. Let's do it. Did I? Did I? Did I do it? Did, yeah. I, did I set this up? To, okay. I guess we're ready. <laughs> I took a drink of water and almost couldn't swallow it. <laughs> well, here we are in Weirding Woods again. Ops mode, Captain Deadbeard. This is fun. I need to be a bird. <laughs> it's a real honor to be a bird with you. Yeah, buddy. I put. What is this one? Hold on. What does this one say? What does this say? This is the... How come we don't get to... Oh, there it is. Loudmouth. Yeah, I knew what that was. Breaker bots. There we go. There's Toothless. Alright, the plants are growing. Teeth. No. 
<laughs> you just refuse to believe, Frat. All right, check this out. I get to be the bird. Nice. Also, one thing I just realized in this game, you don't actually have to have the um, Whoa. like the stuff for the pots and all that. Yeah, it's, yeah, that's a really cool feature. I actually really like that. <laughs> I never really like put it together until now. I wish they still have uh, some of the uh, the other ones though, like the DJ Uplink. Oh yeah. I mentioned there's a lot of stuff like that you really liked and was used to. Yeah, exactly. We can be a little bit more aggressive this time, I guess. Yeah, can't that's we? true. Yeah, we can. Prepare Runs way so to far that they just aggressive. kill everything. Be be aggressive. Be aggressive. Be be aggressive. Usually they sing a little bit more cheerfully, but I know what you were going for. This is cheerful as it gets. <laughs> You're a cheerful guy. What can I say? How are we? <laughs> that was Ursa, I think. Oh, was it? Oh. It's just very loud shaking. <laughs> it's actually pretty fun to stop with him. Yeah, if you, especially if it charges up enough. Yeah, I mean, it's a one shot kill with the pumpkin head and everything, so. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I'm just basically just sitting up here. I wish they would come out faster. I don't know, like, what else. I mean, like, I wish there was, like, a fast forward button. I don't know what I want. Yeah. Person, no, no, don't, don't growl at me. Uh oh. <laughs> it begins. Curse of the Troublemaker. How did that not hit? Dang it. Help. Come on. There we go. <laughs> the snapping is like actually really fun. I've not done much of it. Oh. Head. More like pumpkin dead. <laughs> yeah, for real. After especially after we shoot him. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how did I miss that? Jordan hit my mouse or something. That makes sense. We're in the same room, so. <laughs> <laughs> A lot of people think we're uh, uh, like a thousand miles away, but nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> I need some more damage. What? That nerd got away. <laughs> I think <laughs> nerd. he's one of the only ones left. I just realized where you retweeted my tweet earlier about uh, seeing the lady in the Zack Scott game shirt. I wonder if she saw that by now. I don't know. You you should. <laughs> why didn't you say anything to her? I was like on the complete opposite side of like the store. Like I was deep in front of like the window, having like coffee in a place. Yeah. And uh, there was no way I could have gotten outside in time. Well, what she? But, what, how old was she? <laughs> like probably my age. Awesome. I wonder who it was. Whoever it was. <laughs> thank you for buying the shirt and for wearing it out in public. And for yeah. being my number one fan. <laughs> for for being brave enough to wear it in public. <laughs> uh. There's nothing wrong. There's nothing wrong. <laughs> no, wear mine in public. I'm a normal guy. I don't wear mine in public. <laughs> Do you not? No. <laughs> I don't want people to ask me, like, uh, are you Zach Scott Games? And I'd be like, yeah. I'm uh. like, why are you wearing your own shirt? <laughs> That's right. Actually, I have worn my own one with my face on it, and they're like, "Oh, what's that picture of me?" Yeah, yeah. I, <laughs> oh, it feels okay. weird. Yeah, it's a bit like. And the problem is, yours really looks like you. <laughs> yours isn't even like a cartoon version of you. It's just you. 
Boom. Boom, <laughs> boom. Well, what shirt was it that she was wearing? It was the... Oh, it was actually the limited edition one. So she had gotten it at least a year or two ago. The purple one? Yeah. What? It's the same one that I have. What? Yeah. I, That's why I, mean, I was like, it's got to be someone that really watches you. Oh my gosh. That's crazy. Yeah, that was, was that two years ago? Yeah, or three or four, I, or one, yeah. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah, I mean, it's the same one I have. Three, four, or one. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you said. <laughs> you just have no clue at this point. <laughs> this is fun sniping. It really is, actually. I like this one. Do you have any, like, plans for zombies-related merch? I actually don't remember. I don't. I guess, like, because I'm thinking that shirt is kind of like that. Oh, yeah, like it was inspired, yeah, in a way. Yeah. But, yeah, I couldn't remember anything else, actually. You should have catcalled her. <laughs> yeah, that would have gone well. <laughs> Well, I like the only thing I could think about doing was like knocking on the glass and can you imagine what that would look like? <laughs> like just banging on the glass being like, I know that shirt. Hello. <laughs> hello, hello. <laughs> we are we are alike. You and me have so much in common. <laughs> and like Yeah. <laughs> just be like, hello. That well that's pretty cool. That's a I, I like that story. You should have taken a picture of her. Yeah, yeah, that wouldn't be creepy. <laughs> <laughs> Again, it was very like spur of the moment. Because I was literally sitting there reading New York Times, like of the like debate that happened last night. Oh, yeah. And like, <laughs> then just looked up, saw what went, and I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> I think if I saw that, I'd be like, what the heck? <laughs> I mean, that was, that was pretty accurate of how I felt. I was just like, uh. <laughs> Because I don't think, I mean, the thing is, I've been to, when I was in D.C., um, I was at a really famous bar that's near the White House. Uh, I can't remember the name of it at the top of my head, but it's like where all the senators and stuff go. And there was a little kid with his, like, senator dad or something, just someone in a suit, so anyone. But he was just watching one of your videos on his phone, and I was just like, oh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay. And it was like a video that like uh, was a Fortnite, so it probably had like me in it. I was like, I could really rock this kid's world, but <laughs> could have done it. <laughs> but like, how do you approach that conversation? <laughs> I don't know. Hi, I'm in that video. Hello. <laughs> then the dad punches me. You know, everything happens. Yeah, that'd be funny if you get punched. <laughs> Wait, what? Yeah, I, like punched. <laughs> just, just like punched, you know. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is going pretty well. Uh, yeah. Except I feel like this takes forever, but of course there are fewer waves, but the waves just take a lot longer now. They really do. We. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, jeez. Oh, okay. Yeah, maybe I should be a little more yeah, aggressive no. with, uh... Oh, they're... they're in here, aren't they? The shotgun side of things feel, like, so weak after snapping. I like how it shows all the numbers now. I really do, too. Makes you realize how little damage you're doing now. Yeah, propel it. Like, if I shot you with a shotgun, it'd be like 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, not like 2, 2, 2, yeah. 2, 2, 2. Oh, wow. Oh, I'm nearly dead. Oh, uh, there's chompers back here. Oh, help me. I'm gonna die. Yeah, don't do that. Zach. I'm coming. Ooh. In the game, I'm walking over to you. Awesome. Here we go. Nice. 
Hello. Goodbye. Boom. Adios. Amigos. I don't know how they got so close to us suddenly. I don't either. Well, I'm glad they're coming out now and that we're actually shooting something constantly. Yeah, that's true. A little more interesting, at least. Oh. Oops, I got in the barrel, but sure. I, too, am in a barrel. Huh. Like a fish. Yep, like a fish in a barrel. That's what the saying means. Yeah. <laughs> That's all it is. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Escape, escape, escape. <laughs> wow, that did nothing to you, did it? Huh. I think it's just these guys left. Okay. It doesn't show how many uh, kills each person gets anymore. Yeah, it's a shame. Yeah, this guy is annoying. Going in barrel. <laughs> barrel boy. That's your new nickname. Let's just wave three. Jeez. I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. But we got it. Felt like it went on like half a wave too long. <laughs> uh, yeah, I feel like it went. Yeah. A lot. Yeah, you tell him. I'm gonna get back up. And. Are you ready for I'm gonna some... wake back up. <laughs> hey, Jordan, are we gonna watch all of the XFL? What's the XFL? The new football league that's coming out this year. I don't think I've heard about it. We gotta watch it because it's a brand new football league, so it'll be like a fresh start. Okay. So we can keep up with all the stats and keep our own stats. Okay. With this, with the name X, I have a feeling what it's about, but I'll ask you later. No, it's nothing. It's nothing like that. <laughs> it's it, there okay. used to be the XFL uh, a long time ago, but it was more like like a pro wrestling twist. It was owned by Vince McMahon, and you know. Oh, that's hilarious. But uh, but I mean, with, like it was not like I mean. I don't think it was staged or anything, but what I mean is, like, it used to be, like, a little more... But anyway, so they, they decided to relaunch it, but to be, like, more serious about it. And so, uh, like, they, there's only, like, eight teams. I don't know how many teams. Don't quote me on that. There's only... Okay. <laughs> there's only, like, eight teams across the nation, but our our college coach, uh, Bob Stoops, um, he, oh, yeah. he's coaching the Dallas team. Oh, that's funny. And there's also... I wonder if he's related to Mark Stoops. Yep. I know because that's that's our football coach. <laughs> so I wonder if they're like brothers because that would be funny. No. no, the um, yeah, I don't, I don't know. Uh, the heck was that? The overlay was weird. Oh, got the oak. Oh. Boom. Boom. Oh, yeah, there's more oak over here. This is pretty straightforward. We're getting a lot done. Yeah. I got a few bad boys back here if you don't mind coming back this way. I'm good up here. Okay, cool. See you later. <laughs> <laughs> that way it was quick. I like those. The quick ones are the best. Yeah, it was easy. <laughs> They're the worst, but it was easy. Yeah, so we gotta keep up with the F XFL so that you know, like, we can make our own spreadsheets of all the scores and all the stats, and we can determine who the best players and teams actually are based on our own calculations. Yeah, I'm done for watching it. <laughs> <laughs> does it come on TV or is it gonna be like streamed or how are they doing it? Jeez. Yeah, yeah, I guess it'll be TV or something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's usually how it works. TV or something. <laughs> I don't know. You've not put a lot of uh, research into this, have you? <laughs> Thought we were going to make like a XFL channel here. What and, happened like, with my Zoom? Analytics. My Zoom is, is... I was ready for a full-on analytics channel. My Zoom you know? feels worse. Did I, did I hit something? The... 
Are you sure you're not just having like a, a sleepy breakdown? I'm fine now. I'm no longer sleepy. Are you not? I feel like I can't scroll as fast as I was. Is that true? Did you scroll before? Well, like side to side, you know what I mean? Like. Oh. Uh, are you walking side to side? Maybe I need to die. <laughs> like oh, the, up, the... the up down feels right, but now the the left to right doesn't just feels super slow. Do like, you have like some sort of a button that makes you slower going left to right? Honestly, I don't know. Uh, I hope not. Do you have a pro gaming keyboard? Yeah, but I don't know, man. I mean, you are a professional gamer, so it makes sense. Oh god, the flower's here. There you go. Uh. Oh. Ouch. That hurt my feelings and my body. There we go, I got that. Oh, ow, ow, ow. Like, okay, let me look at the options really quick. I mean, yeah, obviously, I obviously I didn't change them, but like, mouse sensitivity 0.5, mouse aim sensitivity 0.5, they're both 0.5, so. I play on uh, 1 and then 0.5 when I'm aiming. Because it feels too slow otherwise, with the normal look. Broke a shield. Nice. Oh, there's a rose on the thing. Oh, I'm gonna go. That makes sense. Boom. I'm actually more powerful as a goat. <laughs> really? Yeah, because I can just charge everyone so quickly. I could be a goat in real life. Yeah, you could be, I suppose. Greatest of all time. Can <laughs> 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 I get this guy, man? See a guy, man? Yeah, man. Ah, I get it. Okay, so, uh, let's see. What if my little bird comes out? Sounds like a personal problem. Oh well. Oh, uh, shield's back. It's gone now. Yeah. Oh, come on. Triple bombs. There we go. Super beam down. Now what do I do? No. Uh, there's still a flower to get. And a pickle, right? Uh, probably. There's always a pickle. Where's the flower? Oh, I see the pickle. He's in a bit of a pickle. <laughs> um, nice. It's because he's a pickle. It's a real subtle joke. Yeah, because oh, here's the flower. It's like a play on words almost. Yeah, because uh, I think he is some sort of uh, a cucumber. Yeah. So I thought it'd be funny if I said he was like a pickle. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is the kind of commentary you get like, way young. <laughs> uh, this is what happens to your brain on two weeks of Plants vs. Zombies and Plants vs. Zombies only. Heck yeah. Why is he spinning? Like, what's what's his story? Um, you know, Ooh, no one really knows. I might not live. Oh yeah, there's double bad boys here. I'm down on the ground. Oh. Someone save me, someone save me, don't worry. I think it's you. That's me. It's me. 
I must run. <laughs> I may die. Where? Uh... Oh, there's someone on that thing. I think I'm gonna go down, but I'm also gonna maybe take out this guy. Oh no, I'm fine. Oh, for now. <laughs> I like how that did nothing to him. I know, right? The terracotta ones are crazy. Terracotta pie. Oh. I think we have a pickle invasion, yeah. Going back in my barrel. Alright, he's being healed. The flower took like no damage. Yeah, I think I got them both there. Level 7 achieved, baby. Nice. Oh, wow. Why is he throwing yeah, golf balls? Me. I don't like it. Do you think he's the avid golfer? Maybe. He's the John Daly of our generation. The Tiger Woods of our generation. Mm, shoot. He's the Arnold Palmer. I love his ST. He makes good cucumber water. Is that a thing? Yeah. Well, it's like, yeah, it's just basically like water that you put like sliced cucumbers in and then you just kind of let it, the flavors transfer to the water, like infuse. Like, like have you seen like lemon water? Like, you can put fruit yeah. and stuff in water. I've had that, but what flavor is there from cucumbers? It just has like a really nice, crisp, fresh flavor. Like, it's not like overpowering. It's just like. You know, like a, like, you just put like a few, like if you make like a huge jug of water, you put like, you slice up a cucumber and put it in there. Oh, okay. Or like... My favorite flavor of water is that Pepsi. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's not my favorite. <laughs> but... <laughs> also like Mexican Coke. Yeah, that's good, but I haven't had caffeine in months, so... Yeah, that's because you big baby or something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> when I was a baby, my, I used to have coke on my pacifier. That doesn't surprise me. That that really leads up to everything of now, you know. My business is so impressed. He made room in the budget for being impressed. Oh, Mr. Business, sorry. I you just showed him that shivering, squinting, and yarring is silly business. Even though you're be whatever, I skipped it. What's super brains? Do you want me to do super brains? Did you say super brains? Cause I can do super brains easy. If it's super brains, that'd be pretty good. Yeah, super brains. There we go. Got it. That's hilarious. This is gonna be good. Uh, and I do it by respawning first, and then picking super brains. <laughs> Got it's it. It's two a.m. Wow. We just have this one to do, and this is the last one we gotta do. That's true. This is it. Until uh, next week when the new one's out. Yeah, but. <laughs> We're ready. Here we go. This is the last one. Yay. Yeah, and hopefully by the end of this, I'll have all the medals, too. Mm. I'll figure mm. that out. Yeah. Hey, your voice hasn't messed up today, Jordan. I'm not using OBS. Oh, no. I think that's why. What happened? I don't know. Me neither. Okay, let's do what we gotta do. What? I still have the recharge on my things. That's a bar. Right. That's fine. Alright. Stab on the haters. Stab on the haters. That's what you gotta do when you're a, a cool guy like me. Yeah. All right, we got this. I think we're gonna own this. Maybe. I have some experience as super brains. I just realized I had slouched into my chair where I was literally like, my chin was at like near desk hot there for a second. <laughs> nice. I was, I was like railing for a nap, I guess. No naps. No rest for the wicked. Money grows on trees though. Was it from? Is it from a song? Yes. <laughs> Cage for the elephant. <laughs> Used to be the intro music for Borderlands. I think that's why everyone knows it. 
Zach's really excited to play Borderlands 3 as well. I don't plan on playing Borderlands 3. <laughs> Why not? I, I just, I just, I, I don't know. I'm kind of tired of the whole open world thing. I don't blame you. We're killing it. Yeah. I think I've decided after uh, Plants vs. Zombies stuff calms down, I'm going to oh. finally finish uh, the Spider-Man game as well. Oh, that's a fun game. It is a really good game. I just never got to finish it. You cannot play it. Well, I said once this calms down, you know, it's, it's fine. But it never calms down. That's the thing. No, it'll calm down. I, I feel the editing part will <laughs> calm down for sure. Yeah, I think so. Which actually I kind of missed. It's been fun. Maybe not the five hours of sleep, but beyond that, <laughs> you can <could>, you can <could> sleep. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's strict deadlines, you know. There's no there's not strict deadlines. <laughs> it's my own self-imposed ones. Okay, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> man, I know, man, I know, man, I know. I'm being revived. Right thing, Zach. What? I was just asking if I said the right thing, you know. <laughs> Not gonna be punished. Edit out. <laughs> Boom. Okay, we're almost done with wave numero uno. I hilariously almost died because I got really uh, over enthusiastic. So, I mean, like, really, if you're a sunflower on your team, you need to overcharge your teammates because super brains can, like, take out a few of you just, like, with, like, one hit. Yeah. It's kind of ridiculous, but I love it. Yeah. As super brains. As super brains, yes. <laughs> Man, this one guy was, like, totally owning me as super brains, and I just, like, kept trying to just avoid him and, like, stay far <laughs> off from him and snipe. And then the next match, you were super brains. Uh, well, yeah, the next like couple episodes, like, because I was like, I knew I'd have to showcase him, you know, soon. <laughs> so it was a great time to do so. You gotta do what you gotta do, though. You know. Wave two. Her two is better than one. Do what? Ah. Uh. Two for two. T for two. Two tacos is better than one taco. That is the truest thing I've ever heard. Probably the most wisdom I've heard out of you. Well, like, let's say you go to a taco place mm -hmm. and you order a taco. You would have been happier if you would have ordered two tacos. That's true. I've never ordered but just one taco. I think one taco is just a tease. Yeah. I think, frankly, it should be illegal. Yeah, there's a lot that should be illegal. Yeah. I agree. One, the one day when I'm in power, I will make everything... <laughs> no. <laughs> everything that you don't like illegal. Yes. Like, okay, here's an example. Uh, uh -huh. Music videos that include sound effects that are not in the original song. Oh, that's a good one. I don't like that because then like you can't listen to the music video as the song. That that's very true. Or the ones with like the 35 second, uh, or the, even sometimes the three minute opening scenes. Oh yeah, with like the like the acting and stuff like that. Yeah, and it's always the worst. Yeah. Always. Oh man, I got caught up in. I probably have other pet peeves too. Yeah, it happens. Yeah. Oh, here's another one that I don't like. Pet, yeah. pet peeve of mine. Uh, when, when someone a, a restaurant selling sandwiches or whatever, serving sandwiches, and mm -hmm. they put vegetables on that are not good, like they're they're bad quality vegetables. Like everything else is like perfect, but then they throw on like some crappy vegetables. Like, they should've just told me that their vegetables weren't good. You know, like, I, you know what I mean? Like, like, yeah. like especially like, uh, like, it's not impossible to get tomatoes that are in season because, you know, we import them from all around the world. We grow them in, indoors in places. But like, yeah. but like, 
This often happens when tomatoes are not in season. Like, they put on, like, the world's te most terrible, like, non-sweet, like, bland tomatoes. No taste, yeah. And I'm just like, this what? is garbage. <laughs> <laughs> like, this yeah. is, makes the sandwich worse. <laughs> yeah, I just call them hamburger tomatoes. They're just there for texture. Yeah. That's it. And, but if they were, if they, yeah, but they're also just, they're like a bad flavor. Yeah, I, I feel that. So that's another thing that will be illegal under the, the Scott administration. <laughs> <laughs> I like that one. I'm good with that one. <laughs> Going back to, I guess, like music and music videos as well. I have a problem when they, when artists play the song significantly different live. Oh yeah. Like in completely different chord progressions and everything. <laughs> and but then they'll do it differently every single time they play it live. Oh yeah. I found that a few times. So anytime that you're trying to learn a song on guitar, it's just absolutely impossible trying to play it like them. The um I have this problem a lot. <laughs> the uh there was I think. So so I my similar pet peeve is when they it's a popular song and they make mm -hmm. like the audience sing parts like like a large majority of it you know what i mean oh yeah like i just want them to play the song i don't want to sing the song i don't i don't like when they stop and like you say the chorus and like no i don't want i want to hear you say the chorus <laughs> yeah so i had that happen at the jonas brothers concert actually they like made them sing like probably a good half of the song <laughs> yeah i was just i was just like <laughs> yeah, I know, right? They get you tired and everything, and they, they had a 22 song set. Oh, God. So, like, yeah. So, like, it was a lot, I understand, but at the same time, I'm like, this is, like, your most famous song. You just kind of, you know. Yeah. I have to say, I've never been to a concert that was so loud. Really? I've never heard so many, like, screaming people. Do you know, like, the old footage of the Beatles playing where you couldn't hear anything? It was just, like, uh, women yeah, screaming. Yeah. It was like that. I was like, what is going on? Because I don't, I'll be honest, I don't, like, fully know the Jonas Brothers. What? <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, just... <laughs> like, I, I know it, and I know some of their music, and I knew, like, their newer stuff, of course. And I knew, like, some of the, like, famous things that they did when they were younger, but, like, I never knew exactly what they did. Um, they did music. But, yeah, exactly. <laughs> but, like, L, L grew up watching them on Disney Channel and, like, all that stuff, so... Well, yeah. I say grew up. She was a teenager, but <laughs> <laughs> she was an emo teenager, and they had emo hair, so it was she was all in for it. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> what else would be illegal? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't know. I can think of a lot of your pet peeves, but well, I'm not sure if anything could be illegal. Oh, that can't be said on video. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> That's illegal in its own right. Like, okay, Instagram model. Just go to a different platform if you're not, <laughs> you know. <laughs> no, uh, let's see. Uh, what else? I don't know. What was the what was the thing? What was the what was the failure? Uh, speed run apparently. How I didn't can you see speed that. run this? We were doing I as good as we can. Oh, they're on their thing. Uh, it's like on the tip of my fingers. What about when fast food like advertisements look like the things are amazing, but in reality... Yeah, that's kind of a pet peeve. sandwich. It's more... I don't care so much when it's like McDonald's. I know what I'm getting at McDonald's. Yeah. And like places like that. It's more when it's like Subway, where they act like they put a lot of stuff inside of it. Yeah. And then suddenly you get the... Like, you just see bread and nothing else inside of it. I don't go to Subway anymore, if you can't tell. <laughs> <laughs> Unless Subway wants to, you know, like, sponsor us or something. Then, you know, I love Subway. It's great. Yeah. Eat fresh. Eat fresh. Uh, um, <laughs> there's something... So, I mean, when it comes to fast food, you know, I often know what I'm going to get. You know, like like, like you said, like with McDonald's, it's going to be Chick-fil-A. No. Um... <laughs> I do have to say, Chick Fil A looks beautiful most of the time, like exactly as it's supposed to. <laughs> yeah. Also, Chick Fil A has the only fast food workers that seem happy. 
<laughs> yeah, for sure. <laughs> so it's like, it's just like, uh, that's yeah. already a mood thing. Like when you're there and like the fast food workers don't seem like they're happy. I mean, I know it's a, it's a fast food job. So like oftentimes, like when I worked, you know, fast food type jobs, I wasn't like super happy there, but I you put on the show, you know? Yeah. <laughs> I have to say Taco Bell uh, staff is also very good. I think it's because they get like basically free tuition. Oh really? <laughs> that probably helps a lot. Yeah, they get like full. They only get full scholarship, but they get a lot of help with it. Um, or so they're hiring sounds say. <laughs> yeah. But <laughs> they always seem like pretty chipper. Also, uh, there's a very nice thing about living in Kentucky, where most people are typically very, very nice, even if they fake it. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> But like more often, like you, you rarely, rarely find someone who's not us. Uh, but at the same time, yeah, like Chick Fil A is just above and beyond happy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they seem like they genuinely like th this could be their whole career and they would be fine. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like it's like the difference of going to like you know people. No offense, but like. Uh, uh, some people that have seen like working at Walmart, they can be very not happy with the job. Yeah. Uh, and then people working at like, you know, a more designated store that is something they're interested in. Like, you know, Target? I've seen a lot of people yeah. that are quite happy at Best Buy and Target and everything. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's why I don't like going to Walmart is it's just another mood thing. It just doesn't the vibe doesn't feel right to me. Yeah, I'm, I'm exactly the same way. Like Target seems a bit more happy. Um, it yeah. feels like a place for moms, and as a mother, I feel really good about that. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, just, it, I don't know. It's just kind of, yeah. So it's Chick Fil A, Target, Panera Bread's pretty good usually. Yeah, I don't think you have Meyer out that way, but that's a really good one too. It's a supermarket. Oh, here's one. I hate it when they discontinue products that they can clearly just make. Like they have everything oh, yeah. still on on hand. <laughs> <laughs> just, just like, it's like so, when they stopped doing like Pepsi Max at one point. Well, like I'm so I, I'm talking about Taco Bell. Like they just get oh, yeah. a few products. Uh, they can still make a lot of them. Like they can like yeah, because they still have all the stuff to put it together. Exactly. So just like yeah, like come on. Yeah, I get that. But uh, also, do, do they still do the different sizes of Big Macs? Is that a thing? Not anymore. No, they oh, okay. they did discontinue that. Okay, I did like the Grand Mac, but I found that it wasn't really that different than a normal Big Mac. Oh yeah. Yeah, like I, I got all three just to compare. I did two. I did two once. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I just ate them in my car. Not all of them. I had as much as I could of each one. Like a reasonable yeah. amount of each one in the car. Oh yeah, I remember we actually discussed like the sauce portions and like everything. <laughs> yeah. I forgot about that completely. Yeah, one time I ordered uh, the Big Mac, but instead of the normal patties, put on the quarter pounder with cheese patties. Like oh the... yeah, you found out that was like your favorite thing, wasn't it? It was like a huge burger. <laughs> 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 it was great. And the, the, the person in the drive-thru was like, that sounds like a good idea. <laughs> I was like, yes, it is. Because <laughs> I thought of it, Zach Scott. <laughs> <laughs> the, uh, well, because they're, they're, they're so thin, like the patties are so thin, and now they make the quarter pounder with cheese fresh, like, like the uh, uh, the beef patties are the fresh ones. I don't know if it matters, but <laughs> yeah, that's hard to tell. Now there are four bosses. Oh my god. Yeah, and Torchwood. Is it because we have three people? Maybe I don't know. Well, after this is over, we're gonna be done with this part, and we can be yeah. happy. Question though, do you still like Wendy's? Yeah, but I just don't go there that much, and uh, so then maybe that means I don't like them as much anymore. That's fair. I still really like their spicy chicken sandwich. Yeah, yeah, I do too. Um, it's actually probably, if I had to choose, it's probably like my second favorite chicken sandwich. What's number one? <laughs> you know number one, let's be honest. Popeyes. <laughs> no. Oh god, no. Chick-fil-A, baby. Oh, Torch one's back here. Yeah. I told I told you about the Popeyes. My experience with Popeyes is that I couldn't get the idea that, of a fish sandwich out of my head. Yeah, which yeah, like I, I watched your uh, member-only video, which everyone should. Oh um, yeah, yeah, where I talked about it. 
<laughs> yeah, in very in depth. Which I was like, you know what? He could be a chicken like sandwich reviewer. I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah. Uh, there's actually a. He might not be a little boy anymore, but he was in. Uh, he's in London, and he reviews chicken shops. What What is that? Um, so it's just shops that serve like oh, uh, chicken parmos. Yeah. Uh, I thought you said chops, so, like, like lamb chops. I was like, what are yeah. chicken chops? <laughs> no, <laughs> I was like, like oh. different places that just serve like chicken, uh, like fried chicken or whatever it may be. Yeah. And he yeah. would do like quite in depth reviews and he's actually gotten like really popular and he was like on all the like big news stations. Like uh, uh, there's one called This Morning there and a bunch of other stuff and it was really funny. But I think he's made a full business out of it. And I think he's like maybe. I mean, the, I, can't, I can't imagine he's more than like 15 at this point, if that. Nice. But I was like, you could totally do the fast food version of that easily. Yeah, well, I, <laughs> I've, you know, I've thought about doing fast food reviews or just food reviews or in general, but I didn't know if, yeah. I didn't know if I could break into it, you know, like, because there's a lot of good people who do that and. Yeah. And also, I know a lot I just of people. Don't anyone that's as in depth as you, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've yeah. never seen someone care so much about it. <laughs> there's like a there's a passion when it comes to you. <laughs> the thing. <laughs> yeah. The other hard part about fast food reviews is that each fast food restaurant's a little bit different, so it's very possible I just got an, I got an, a Popeyes that wasn't very good. That's true. I guess that's why you got to go to like a couple. And the thing is, you would. I know you. <laughs> Well, I mean, like, I haven't been to, like, a bad Chick-fil-A, you know, and but, like, the Popeyes that I went to was, like, rated, like, three or something, like, on Google Maps. So, I'm just oh, like, well. Okay. I guess it really depends what it was rated three for. Yeah, if it's service or what. I don't know. Yeah. Like, the thing was, Ashley liked, Ashley liked the Popeyes sandwich pretty well, and she actually liked the, the, the that it tasted well, kind of like a fish sandwich. Yeah, <laughs> so it's like likes fish though, doesn't she? Uh, well, no, actually she doesn't. <laughs> so, totally. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah, not not too she much. But she was uh, like really. I thought she ate a lot of fish for some reason. No, she. We we do eat tilapia and stuff. She doesn't like salmon. She doesn't like fishy fish. Oh, okay. Thanks. See, I really hate like most fish, but salmon's the one that I can almost eat. <laughs> that's like a really kind of fishy fish, so that's pretty funny. Yeah, that's funny. <laughs> I, well, I grew up eating. Um, I don't know what they're actually called. I guess they're like fish cakes, but like, we call them salmon patties. Oh yeah, that's uh, yeah. Um, we call them salmon patties too. Yeah, but they're like so. No one else seems to know about that for some reason. But they're like you know obviously mega fried basically. Yeah. But uh, yeah, I, I really really like those. I still like those, but. See, I haven't had them in a long time, but my grandmother used to make them, and uh, basically canned <laughs> salmon that with whatever breadcrumbs or whatever. Yeah, that was always the thing. It was it was always really good, but I don't know if I would still like it. Uh, I don't know. I was actually my parents lied to me saying it wasn't fish. Said it was like just a weird like burger thing, and I was like accepting of that because <laughs> okay. I wasn't if I knew it was fish. Oh yeah, but <laughs> yeah, just a burger. <laughs> just a burger. Yeah. Like, sure. So I knew it was fish when I was a kid, but like I ate, I, I mean, that was like one of the meals. Like we would have sides, like you know, green beans and mac and cheese or whatever along with it. But yeah, um, you, you know, like yeah, I think because you know my grandparents maybe coming from a more different era, they used a lot of canned foods in their cooking. Oh yeah, I remember that. And so like, uh, so yeah, the salmon patties were probably canned salmon with uh, whatever kind of mixture for the breading that goes inside. Yeah. I don't think I've used much other than like maybe uh, Elle really likes these their Wolfgang Pug soups. Yeah. She really likes them, but like I don't think we ever really have anything out of can anymore. Yeah, <laughs> I still like canned corn because it it doesn't really change much from corn on the cob in my opinion. That is that is very true. Just my opinion. I'm pretty, probably like a corn connoisseur out there. It's like oh my god, canned corn is the worst. <laughs> corn connoisseur. Yeah. I want to meet that person. <laughs> but oh, I was gonna say, if you like salmon patties, you might like crab cakes. It's the same concept, but with crab meat. So I've been very tempted to try that as well. I've had imitation crab. Didn't mind that at all. I don't know if it would be very similar in taste, because I assume that they would make it taste very similar. Yeah. I don't know. Um, uh, if you go to like a seafood restaurant, uh, like and they have like Maryland style crab cakes, 
And mm. so, you know, some mess it up, but some do it really good. Of course, if you're in Baltimore, then I can give you a ton of recommendations or two recommendations yeah. for where to go to get crab cakes. <laughs> well, that works out because I'm not being there. Maybe the end of next month. So who knows? That would be cool. I there's a restaurant called Timbuk Two that I highly recommend. Oh, uh, yeah, my um, my brother and sister in law actually go there every so often, so it makes sense. Nice. Yeah, <laughs> we would go there when I would, we would travel there for work, and they had great crab cakes. I would always get crab cakes. Uh, hey, we did just it. Move to Baltimore for crab cakes. I don't know if I want to move to Baltimore. <laughs> <laughs> Although it's nice, I guess. Oh well, I don't know. Yeah. I heard. I uh, obviously like maybe the suburbs are nicer, <laughs> but we did it. Yeah, we did it. How do I say to, to Toothless that we did it? Uh, I think you. Well say, done. There's got to be one that says we did it. Uh, Tim Marshmallows see. collected. I get a medal for that? Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> no. <laughs> let's see. Surely I get a medal for this. Uh, let's see. Twenty-five crates. Yeah, I, I guess I did somewhere. <laughs> it's in there somewhere. Uh, or was it was it required? I mean, I don't even remember the medal. Anyway, but for <laughs> progress, we did get it all complete. So now I just got to finish up the chests. I only have two chests, and then the gold chests and the gnome chests. I got to get four more gnomes. I get two more audio logs. Well, actually, by the time of this record, I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to edit it together. But this is where it looks, what it looks like right now. <laughs> so, yep. <laughs> thanks, Jordan, and thanks, Toothless, for joining me. Yeah. Nap time. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I am back to solo mode. All right, looks like there's a gnome right up here. Darn it, I missed him. Uh, can I just, <laughs> just jump on here? Oh, it's a race. It's a race. We'll go this way. Okay. I kind of thought that might be a race. Go faster, please. Where's the next one? All right. Things are good. Things are good. All righty. Oh, there's a, okay. There's a golden nub. Great. Got it. Excellent. Wow. Okay, looks like there's a gnome right here too. Okay, that one I just collect. Okay, perfect. Perfect, no big deal. All right, clearly there's a gold chest behind here. So let's get it. This is gonna be part of the costume set. Nice. To have and to gold, what does that mean? Did I get all the gold chests? Now, how many gnomes do I have? Scouting glasses, nice. How many gnomes do I have left at this point? I only have two that's exciting right two okay let's find him okay there's a gnome behind okay i don't have to go behind the fence perfect this was just uh over here basically if you want to know uh this was like the no you know the gnome type area and this is just uh you go up here on top of the tr the train boom there it is oh my gosh there's a chest up there all right hold on how do i get up there Let's find out if I can make that jump. I don't know. Can I get on top of the train here? Dang it. Okay, hold on. I gotta figure out how to get up on top. Maybe it's not so bad. Maybe it's just as easy as jumping up here. Hold on, here we go. This is why I'm super brain, so I can make these awesome jumps. Nice. Got it. Marshmallows, always delicious. Okay, surely this would be like another something to check out. Leave me alone, mushrooms. Okay. I'm being beat up by mushrooms. There's probably a gold chest in here. Gosh, can I get my my stuff back? There we go. And a gnome. Awesome. That was the last gnome. And this is a gold chest. So, no, I still had more gold chests left. No more gnomes. Excellent. Okay, I clearly should have looked into this area more over here because clearly there's a chest right here. And this is my last normal chest, I think. I just got a chestnut. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta just find some more golden ones. So I'll check all the places. Oh, here's something. Audio log. Okay, great. How many of those? I think I need one more of those. Excellent. Okay, I think I, yep, yep, up here. There's an audio log. 
Got it. This is the last audio log. Okay, I definitely see a chest up there. I just gotta make it up there this time and land in the right spot. I don't know how I didn't see this last time, but this is the last chest I have, the last collectible other than, you know, metals. I guess you can consider metals collectibles in a way. But you see right there, it's so easy. How did I not see that last time? Yeah, it's just right over there, what the heck? All right, perfect. I can't believe I didn't see this last time. But there we go, all that glitters is gold. Now I can, uh, whoa, Gate of Croc Victory Slab, that's really cool. Now I can go uh, turn into gnomes. All right, and these chests over here actually count as chests, so this is exciting. We'll have all the chests done after this. Greed Eternal Punchers, that's really cool. And then of course some coins, I need those coins. And then we also got a uh, Prostickety Vault. Nice, very cool, very, very cool. And then more coins as well. Boy, so now I just gotta get the medals, and then uh, once I get the medals, things will be great. All right, I'm in Z-Tech Factory, and there's a metal called Organ Donor to reach the top of the pipes. This kinda looks like an organ in a way, right? Kind of. <laughs> but I'm gonna see if that's it, because these are some pipes. I've been trying a bunch of different pipes. This is probably it. All right, did we do it? No, there'll be an achievement. There's the there's the tallest pipe. Did we do, we did it, nice, okay. <laughs> I'm glad that one's over. All right, I forgot to turn the audio logs in. So here we go, that's all 10 logs. Their audio really covered up the sound of those um, ducks. Well, I'm all done in here. Time to finally leave this outhouse. I can't wait to breathe fresh air. It's good for my brain, which you keep asking about. Just gotta finish this interesting magazine article on Frisbee golf. Froth, they call it, ha. Huh. Feel like I owe you something. I found this in here. It's no froth article, but it's shiny, thanks. So what did he give me? All right, staying occupied, a medal, of course. 50,000 coins. And I guess that's about it. Darn. Can I go over there? Nope, 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 nope. Oh, come on. Uh, okay, that's fine. Unrevivable. Boom, boom. Broke a car. Cannonball? What was that? Cannonball. I don't remember one called Cannonball. Okay. Jump into loss. Okay, got it. That's easy. Uh, stand on the tarp in the campground. Stand in a bird's nest. So where's the tarp in the campground? What was the other one? Uh, sorry. The trial by fire. What's that? Light the campfires. How do I do that? Reach the top of the camp near lake sign. Okay, that should be easy. Top of the camp near lake sign. That shouldn't be too hard. Where's the tarp, you think? Done. There we go. Sign of the times. Ow, don't shoot. What do you think the tarp is? Oh, there's a big old flower. What the heck is that? What, what the heck? Hold on. Sleepy. Jeez Louise. Is this someone I have to vanquish or is this just for fun? Darn. It's a pretty big flower. Oh, I gotta go all the way back? You gotta be kidding me, dude. Let's go, though. There's a marigold. All right, here we go. Should have been easier with Jordan. And 
try to stay back. Oh my god. Sleepy's annoying. So that means I just gotta respawn and come back. And I spawn all the way over here, which is also annoying. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I feel like I need to take out Sleepy first. Sleepy's annoying because Sleepy has, like, oh my god, Sleepy, stop. Sleepy, you're super annoying. Like, what do I do? Oh, I'm stunned. Go heal for a second. I'm stu I'm, I'm hypnotized or something. Help! Dang it, I'm dead again. Alright, this is gonna be a tough fight, but... Okay, thankfully I spawned near it, though. Wait, or did I? Where the heck? No, I didn't spawn near it at all. I don't know where the tarp is. Oh, good god, okay. Sleepy is super annoying. God. All right, Sleepy destroyed me again. Sleepy has a gnome hat on. I think she's working for the gnomes. All right, Sleepy's in a rainbow form again. Come on, stop at the rainbow. All right, elusive foe, Sleepy, nice. There we go, I got Sleepy. So Sleepy was one of the elusive foes. Oh boy. Okay, this is probably the tarp right here. I'm in the tarp. I'm in the tarp. Does this not count? I'm in the tarp. So there we go, finally got it. All right, cool. All right, there's a fire that's not lit. Is there any, any way for me to pick up the fire, like set my cape on fire or something? My hair, okay, my hair's on fire. Will this light it up? Nice, that, li oh, there's 11 left. There's a lot of fires left. So I guess, I, oh, there's a trash can. Litter me this. <laughs> I knew that was one of the things to destroy. Uh, so let's see where the rest of the fire, I mean the fires could be like literally anywhere. But there's 11 left, that's a lot to look into. So we're basically just looking for fires, like empty fires. Oh, there's one. Hold on, there's one just right next to it. Holy cow, these are hard to see. All right, ten lit. There's a fire right there. Okay, let's let's get, let's light this fire. There we go. Nine left. All right, there's a fire right across. A lot of these fires are just right next to each other. Then I run. There's one, there's one over here. Seven left. After this, there'll be six left. So literally, I'm just have to find fires. No, it's out. Wait, did I lit a fire? Oh, I lit a fire! Okay, five left, so this is probably the one I do. Dang, almost. I didn't get it. Come on, dude. <sighs> there we go. Got it. Four left, though. So he's got to locate four more fires. S'more, s'more. What is that? That's probably for the mushrooms. I mean, uh, marshmallows. 
three left. I just lit that one. Two left. There's one. There's one. Alright, nice. One left somehow, somewhere. There it is, there's the fire. The last one right there. What the heck? Let's see if the engineer's a little bit faster with his, his, his jump. Alright, here we go. I'm wearing a helmet. I'm faster, yeah, I carry the torch. Great, great, get out of here, oh my god. The fire's blue, are they all blue? No? That fire is blue. Let's go check it out. It might be the trial by fire metal that we have to get. I don't know. A roast marshmallows, okay. Trial by fire started, what the heck? Okay, hold on. Spooky squash has appeared. What the heck? Oh god. I don't know if this is the right character to be. What the heck? Oh my god. Oh my god. The answer is no. This is not the right character to be. What the heck? <laughs> okay. Let's switch back to Super Brains. Maybe. Uh, here we go. Let's give this a shot. Wow. That was brutal. Fire plants regenerate. Good. Please, what the heck, dude? Oh my god, the squash. Oh my god. Oh no. Okay, I can't I can't do close-up confrontations with these. What the heck? Okay, I need to we need to respond. I need to be something who can reach him from afar. Uh yeah, him. Probably. What the heck? Don't move. Oh, you mushrooms, get the heck out of here, dude. Jesus, okay. That's too slow. I only have two minutes to pull this off. What are you, are you kidding me? Oh, how about the, how about the bird? How about the bird? Leaving activity, no I'm not. What the, god dang it, leave me out of this. Oh my god. Okay, let's respawn. This is not good. What about just the foot soldier or something? What the heck is this? Oh my god. Fire plants, please get out of here. You gotta be joking. Kidding me, dude. Get out of here. Get out of my life. God, four, what the heck? I hate these guys, do I not attack, what do I do? No, he's too strong. This is not good. Yeah, I have a minute and, and whatever to get him. That just isn't gonna work. And there are no lawnmowers here either to use on this guy, unfortunately, so. Move champions. Oh my god. I don't even have, okay. I only have 52 seconds. I don't even know if I could do this. Shoot, dude, what the heck? Get out of here, champion. What the heck? There's no way. I mean, he's close, but he's not 30 seconds close. He's half, is what I mean. Oh my god. I hate this. Oh yeah, I don't think there's any real hope with this, honestly. Yeah, no way. 
No overtime either, probably. I'm gonna have to clear these for next round. Yeah, trial by fire failed. Alright, but we can start it up again. Because uh, if I get full health, uh, he'll, he's gonna come out. No more mushrooms right there, right? Maybe that hits him? It does, nice. That's actually a really good strong start. Oh, what the heck, where is he going? What the heck? Okay. Freaking mushrooms, oh my god. Stop it. Why is he in there? What the heck? Can I please be left alone while I try to kill this stupid squash? There he is. He's almost actually done. God dang it. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? No, where's the squash? There he is. The heck, dude, get out of here. Dang it! Oh, no! Alright, let me just respawn. We got two minutes and 30 something seconds. This could work. I can't believe he came down here. Two minutes left of this. Seriously, mushroom, leave me alone. It's not the time. Got him. Roasted root vegetables. Let me get some mushrooms. Trial by fire complete. Oh, darn it. Oh, there's one. So you can actually destroy these satellite dishes. That's two. That's exciting. Then there's one up here that surely will, will be able to be destroyed as well. Three, there you go. Communication breakdown, that's a metal. There you go, real crate shooter from destroying all those crates. All right, I'm standing in the bird's nest, but the metal isn't activating. I've heard that there's some issues with this particular uh, this particular metal activating for some players. And so, I don't know if they're, I guess they're gonna patch it. And when they do, I'll be able to collect this metal. I suppose, <laughs> I hope. Oh, it's Pop Cyclops. I beat enough to get him out. Oh, he goes, he goes invincible during this phase under, underground, I guess. Oh, he killed me though. The Pop Cyclops is out here. Let's get him. Man, this place is a maze. I don't even know where I was. Who's that? That's not Pops. That's not Pops. Where the heck was Pop Cyclops? Stop shooting me. Oh my god. I'm trying to find Pops here. This pops. Gosh, dang it. Which one's pops? I didn't spawn where I was. There he is. Oh my god. Come on! Okay, fine. Respawn now. Yeah, he's over here. That's not him. That's him. Dang it. Gosh, dang it. You gotta, oh, I have a shield. Maybe consider using that next time. I don't know. Alright. And he 
goes under and it's rainbow colored. Alright, there we go. Nice. We get the we get the hang of this, probably. Hold up. What? No. Alright, nice. Pops, Cyclops, come get me. No, don't don't come get me. Never mind. Change my mind. Oh man, I thought I was blocking that one. Alright, alright, we're gonna get him. We're gonna get Pop Cyclops, don't worry. Boom, got him, elusive foe. Pop Cyclops defeated. Oh, there it is, Amber Gemma. Holy cow. I didn't even know it was gonna be a P, but the Amber Gemma's here already. Excuse me, I'm trying to get to Amber Gemma. Excuse me. Amber, stop it, stop it, Amber. Okay, well, Amber Gemma is is <laughs> being hard to fight. Okay, so let's get over to it. We're gonna do the Ultra Ball. Only 75, darn. It's okay, I'm gonna focus strictly on Amber Gemma because she's like the last thing I have to do here. All right, elusive foe, Amber Gemma eliminated. I, I seriously did this about seven or eight times before she finally showed up. So now we can we, we can leave this area, and all I gotta do, I have all medals except for the one that's glitched, and except for the one uh, that is uh, requires you to buy items. So I have a ton of marshmallows, so let's go buy some items. Uh, who's the guy I buy items from? <laughs> leaving, that's fine, leaving activity. Is it this guy over here? No, who has the items? It's a shop. There it is, right there. Auto do, auto do, I guess, is his name. So over here, uh, what was that? Hold on. Oh, just a can candle on top of a computer. There he is. Okay, so. Hey, buddy, I need to buy some stuff, of course. I have a ton of mushrooms, so let's go ahead and buy some stuff. Uh, if you take a look, uh, you know, I, I, I could use this. This is a Tiki Surprise uh, Victory Slab. And that'll meet the requirement for the uh, metal. But I might as well buy uh, the Feathered uh, Flotilla as well and then uh this is the snake sandal <laughs> pink toenails love that uh we also got the uh, mouth digger looking good super safari set and then uh what else we got oh we got safari glasses nice Looks like a snake. And then we got a super safari hat. And we still have some marshmallows, so we're gonna use them a little, you know, see what we can do here. Uh, so I can't afford that one yet, but I can afford this one, which is Team Wolfie. Looks really cool. Gonna purchase it. Now I just need to save it for the rest. But like I said, uh, if you take a look, he'll give us the medals. Be disappointed, check. I'm not disappointed, I'm happy. So, uh, let's see the metal pop up. Spindin' a Marsh Moolah. So, if you take a look at the metals, uh, we have everything except for one metal, and that metal is glitched. And so, as soon as they patch it, it might be uh, it might be in October, then I'll be able to actually claim that I have all the metals. Uh, but other than that, you know, I, I'm basically 99% complete. This is basically 100% complete, minus the metal that's glitched. So, thanks for watching. See you next time for more. I'm Zach Scott, subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help this channel grow, all you gotta do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop.